Hey. This must be the secret agent high-tech weapons that they were talking about. Bang, 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 um... Um, okay, okay, don't panic. Don't panic, everything is fine. What's up, guys? Welcome to I Expect You to Die. So after having so much fun playing Just In Time Incorporated, I asked you guys for a similar VR experience, and so many people recommended this game to me. And after looking into it, like, honestly, I don't know why I didn't check it out sooner. It looks like such a cool game. You are a secret agent spy, and you get sent out on secret agent spy missions. Now, very similar to James Bond, with the difference being James Bond is a poser, right? I am clearly the better spy, but nobody believes me. So uh, I'm just going to have to prove it to people. Spy training, right? I don't remember Bond needing any spy training, so I don't need any spy training. Would he have been able to do that? Probably not. I will, however, take my spy opening credits, though. Yeah, with the sexy girl silhouette and the shooting the camera, I can't let him have better production values than me. Whoa. You must think you're so clever. I promise you, agent, can't escape me for Okay. Bond would have done that. a game you take from me, I take from you. But every game ends, and when this one is through, this is amazing. I expect you to die. Oh my god. This is the coolest opening credits die. I have ever seen. I expect you to die when you finally see the worst side of me will finally be eye to eye. I expect you to. in your ear they've no chance to save you a mere puppeteer they only enslave you you're a piece on a board i bet with my wealth my armies and dreams oh it's the bear hat success a male still greater schemes a lake full of vast a drill from the sky if you try to fight me Oh, not my balls again, please. I expect you to die. Wow! James Bond can eat my ass. That was better than anything he has ever had. Unfortunately, the credits don't count for much, so we're gonna have to do Operation Friendly Skies. We're calling this mission Operation Friendly Skies. I hope you like cars and airplanes, and cars in airplanes. Dr. Zor. Corporate billionaire by day, underhanded villain by night, has a cargo plane scheduled to depart for Zanzibar this very evening. We need you to infiltrate the plane before it takes off, gain access to the vehicle held within, and drive it right off the airplane. Our intel assures us Zor's car is equipped to handle a fall from any height, so we're almost positive you won't die. Almost positive, Press great. Press the start button to begin your mission. Seems simple enough, right? Drive a car out of a plane before it reaches Zanzibar. Why is it always Zanzibar? Oh. My superior secret agent intuition is telling me that the room filling with gas is a bad you thing? You may be wondering why this car can never reach Zanzibar. That it too. has some of the most high-tech weaponry in Dr. Zor's considerable arsenal. Naturally, we'd like to poke at it a bit. 
drive it off the plane, and you may just earn that vacation you're always going on about. Yeah, high-tech weaponry. I'm sure it's not because it's super spacious and has fine wood grain finish. Look at this thing. It's beautiful. Okay, let's see what we're working with here. Hello. Okay, you know what? It's probably five o'clock in Zanzibar. Let's start things off really right. Early to celebrate, don't you think? Don't judge me. You have any idea how far a plane ride it is to Zanzibar? Because I honestly don't. <laughs> Where's these weapons? Ooh. Okay, you know what? I'll get to the weapons eventually. Don't even worry about it. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. You know, smoking may cause a slow and painful death. <laughs> yeah, you know what doesn't cause a slow and painful death? Driving a car off a plane. Going splat is a pretty quick death. Okay, here we go. First step to driving would be starting the vehicle. Yeah, that's the stuff. Oh yeah, whatever you say, sweetheart. There we go. Scan failed. Targeting. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Ah, my retinas! Cause of death was laser blast, was it? I wasn't sure. Okay, now I'm seeing the weapons. They just leave little treats all over the place and then blow your head off. We are going to have to start the car eventually, though, right? Because I need to drive it out of the plane. But I guess I can't really do it right now with the plane closed. So maybe we'll just find a workaround to this in the car. Like, what do we have? Oh, here we go. Okay. We got ourselves a knife. Not sure what I would use the knife for just yet. Hey, this must be the secret agent high-tech weapons that they were talking about. Bang, 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 um, um, okay, okay, don't panic. Don't panic, everything is fine. Okay, you know what? That, that might have been my bad. The retina burning gas. Mission failed, poison gas, yes. Thank you for clarifying. We're just gonna slow things down, okay? We're just gonna take a second, we're gonna think things over, we're gonna read the paperwork that comes with the death car. How about that? We have faulty cannon, reset system. So if I need to reset the cannon, we now know how. I need a screwdriver, I can get rid of that panel. Okay, good to know. We also have, uh, uh, um, that, hopefully this wasn't important. Oh, come on, man. What is this? Uh, auto-deploy parachute. Okay. So, we're fine here, right? It's auto-deploying. This thing is freaking dangerous. What else do we have? How to arm your bomb? I see you dancing over there. Why would I want to arm a bomb? <laughs> okay, we're just gonna leave that for now. I, I think I know what I need to do to progress. So, the way that it works is when I start the car, it gives me an audio cue, which means I'm progressing. So I need to resolve this thing next. So how about we present our retina? Scan failed. Targeting. And then we burn you a little bit. How about them? Oh. Deploying secondary countermeasures. That's kind of rude. I, I, I wanted that. I don't want that. Oh, the old ticking bomb. I'm partial to plastic explosives myself, but you must respect the classics. I believe diffusing bombs is covered in basic training, yes? Uh, I didn't do basic training because I'm better than Bond. <laughs> okay, but this is how to arm your bomb. Uh, maybe I can just... You'll need to cut those wires, Agent. Oh, oh, right, okay. So let's just, uh, eh, and there we go, eh. Now I can use you to grab this. That doesn't sound good. What? Did the lighter just light the ball? Oh, come on! <laughs> I need to be more careful. Bomb explosion, thank you, I wasn't aware. Things that we've learned so far. Don't leave an open flame in the car. Don't let the poison gas in. Don't look directly into a laser. So we're learning. We're just gonna get this real quick and put you there. So this is how to arm your bomb. One, two, three. Then I would assume disarming it would be three, two, one, right? So how about we just take you? Okay, you just hang out right there. Let's get this started. Intruder detected. Present 
eye for retina scan. Okay, so we do this. Oh, oh, I I didn't scan bring my cigar. Targeting. Uh, how about I just? Laser avoided. Deploying secondary countermeasures. That works. Okay, secondary. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. <laughs> You'll need to cut those wires, agent. Okay. Three. Uh, two. And one. No ticking is good ticking, as they say. Now, can we please focus on getting the car out of the plane? Yeah, okay. Just, just give me a second, okay? I didn't even do basic training. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> so, this was very important. How about we get all of them just in case? I don't think this one is super important, like I said, because it auto-deploys. You, however, probably something I'm going to do next. Faulty cannon reset system. Right. Oh! So... Weapons offline. Right. These... Weapons offline. Weapons offline. Next message. Zor, there is an urgent matter we must discuss. Contact me on a secure line immediately. Interesting. Okay. Um, I like you. I could take you with me. No, I don't mind having a sassy femme robot. As long as you don't shoot me in the face anymore. So the weapons are offline. If I want to get out, I'm willing to bet that I need to fire my way out. I just need to figure out how to go about doing that. So the button is underneath this, but I need to get it out. Can I? I've seen you do many creative things with a knife, but I don't think turning screws will be among them. Wow. You are very up to date as to what I'm doing. That's kind of creepy. Uh, oh. Well, how am I gonna get it out there? Can I just drive out? What if we just, what if we just do this? Yeah. Honestly, Agent, we want the car in one piece. Nothing short of an explosion is going to make a dent in that cargo door. Oh, nothing short of an explosion, huh? Okay, we're just gonna back it up a little bit. Yeah, that's good, put her in park. Hmm, now, how am I going to get you? I don't suppose I could just open the door real quick. Actually, yeah, the gas didn't technically kill me right away. So what if I, and then, uh, uh, and then up, 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 up. <coughs> yes, <laughs> okay. Yes, all right, now we're getting somewhere. So you learn from your mistakes. Master reset. You got anything to say about that? No? Okay, well I'm just gonna hit this button then. System resetting. Weapons online. Nice! So let's just blow our way out of here. Oop! Okay! Woo! Yeah, I'm starting to see why they might want this car! Now, what did you say? Uh, I need to load something into it? Right! That was these. I thought they were beers, but nope, they're smoke grenades. Uh... I mean, that kind of works for me, right? Eh. Hmm. In retrospect, why would a smoke grenade... Oh, right! I still have bombs! What if I just load one of you in? Boop! Yeah! A bit unconventional. But then again, convention never was your strong suit. You'd better drive the car off the plane before something else explodes. Yeah, I'll get to it. Don't, don't you worry. I'm not in any kind of rush, right? We're just gonna... There we go. I'm gonna finish off this whole bottle in victory. Can I celebrate now, or are you gonna keep judging me? I definitely don't condone drinking and driving, but... Drinking and driving off a plane's probably okay, so we're just gonna drive our way up. Whee! <laughs> that was a great mission! Parachutes deployed. Okay, good. Yes. Only took me six minutes. Another successful mission. Now, about that vacation. I'm afraid I lied about that. But I believe hard work is its own reward, don't you? For a second there, I thought he was going to say I get a vacation in Zanzibar. But this is even worse. Oh. I see you brought back some explosive souvenirs. Nothing wrong with that, I suppose. Keep it up. We finished dissecting Zor's car, and only two technicians died in the process. A new record. Hey, congratulations. A few of Zor's car phone messages were from the head of a pharmaceutical company that produces lady shampoo. I hope they have plenty on hand, because things are about to get hairy. And dirty. Thus the, the, the need for the shampoo. 
Anyway, your next mission is waiting for you at the door when you're ready. I really like that. So it's not just finishing the mission. You can do that to advance because we have another mission waiting for us over there. But you can also go back and do it again to get different souvenirs to decorate your office. So we have the smoking break, we have the liquor, we have the bomb part. Really? They brought the live bomb parts to my office? <laughs> I should really put this thing down. It's a little bit dangerous. Bulletproof windows, though. Very smart. Bulletproof sunglasses as well. They thought of everything. So we still need to get guns away, which must use the revolver in the back seat. Make it rain, which probably has to do with all that money. And then speed run of 35 seconds. I could definitely beat that in 35 seconds, right? Q, buddy, I need you to shut up for just a second, okay? Because I'm wasting a lot of time by grabbing the money. Here we go. I'm just gonna open that up. I'm gonna go get you, and you. This can get opened up. Yeah, there you go. Scan that right now. I'm gonna restart this right now. Come on. Come on, give me the knife. Uh, dodge you. And you We're good. Secondary measures. Can I? Yes, there we go. Okay. Uh, yellow. I'm Blue, to plastic green, in, no fire, good as put her say. in a drive, and go, 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 go. I feel good about that. Come on, 35 seconds. Parachutes deployed. 34 seconds, yes! Now, Revolver, I know we haven't always gotten along because you've choked me to death with poison gas, but I need you in my office, so I need to do some kind of objective with you. Maybe I can shoot where the gas is coming out? Or the gas? Yeah, let's try that. Can I just lean out the car? Ah. Come on. Nope, nope, that, that's a bad thing. Okay, windows up, kids, windows up. Choking to death. So, I'm not supposed to shoot something outside the car? I could shoot one of these windows? No. These boxes? Am I out of bullets? I'm out of bullets. Well then, you choked me to death again. How dare you? So I found all the stacks of money, but I don't know how to make it rain. Like, I can't take them out individually, and tossing them around doesn't seem to do anything. I get the feeling it has something to do with you. So how about we just have uh, one for me, and one for you? And then... I don't know. Rain. Right, right, rain. Rain. Maybe? No? Hmm. Oh, maybe I should load the money into the gun. I'm willing to bet that would make it rain. Okay, so let's get the gun up and running. It's also kind of interesting that this button is the one that activates the weapons. What do the other ones do? System resetting. Weapons online. Okay, so this one lit up. That's weapons. But you. Nothing. You? Deploying scorpions. Scorpions? Ah, scorpions! Ah, stab them! What do you mean, scorpions? Are you nice? Uh, he doesn't seem to really care. He's a bit of an aloof scorpion. Okay, you just hang out down there. Uh, you? More scorpions, maybe? Next message. Oh. So, there is an urgent matter. We already heard this. Contact okay, um, weapons, please. So, if I take myself some money... And, yeah, there we go. Skaboosh! Yeah, there we go. Okay, make it rain. That will teach Zor to use his car as a piggy bank. I was kind of hoping that this was going to answer all my problems, but uh, apparently not. So we still don't know what to do with the gun just yet. Hmm, maybe if we drive around, let's just take a little look. What's going on around here? Honestly, Agent, we want the car in one piece. Nothing short of an explosion is going to make a dent in that cargo door. Put your belly aching. Maybe I can just shoot my way out of this? Deploying secondary countermeasures. That worked? <laughs> Was that it? Ticking bomb. I'm partial to plastic explosives myself. I don't know if I did a good thing or not. I shot a bunch of stuff. So we figured out make it rain and we got the speed run, but I have no idea what I need to do for guns away. So you know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of I Expect You to Die, guys. I'm really enjoying this game. This is awesome. So if you guys want to see more, as always, be sure to leave a like on the video, leave a comment letting me know, and then maybe James Bond's better brother-in-arms will return to dazzle you with his incompetence once again.
But thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.